Do I have any horror stories? It depends. Horror stories about what? <laughs> about ghosts? Oh my god, you guys want ghost stories? I'm trying to think because I think lots of paranormal stuff has happened to me throughout life. Any stories of when you use your psychic powers? Um, I mean, I've talked about it before how I've had dreams. I guess the technical term is uh, premonitions. And you would think that having something like that, or I guess, I don't know, being quote unquote gifted with something like that is cool or something, but it's not really all that cool. It's nice when, you know, it's about a good thing, but most of the time it's not something good and I have to give people a warning. <laughs> and and it is, yeah, it's exhausting, true. Is this Final Destination? Um, I mean, I kind of relate, but also not, not to that level. Like, that's, like, very exaggerated. Sometimes when I'm in a vehicle, like, if I'm in someone's car or if I'm on the bus and I just look out the window and we're just like, you know, I'm just going somewhere, not even anything special. It turns, like the vehicle turns a corner or something. Um, I'll see like, it. Would, sometimes it's an animal or sometimes it's a person. Um, and it'll look like, it'll look like the car or the bus is like, run them over. But obviously if that a actually happened to a physical being, you know, the situation would be very different. Yeah, I, uh, stuff like that like happens to me sometimes. It's not like, it's not scary, I guess. It's just kind of like, it's just surprising. <laughs> yeah, ghost. Ooh. <laughs> I remember distinctly one time when I was younger and I was a child, my family was driving somewhere. I saw a dog in the distance, like in the, like in a short distance trying to like cross the street and I remember like looking at the dog it was just minding his business the car just like kept going and it kept going and it like went through the dog I don't even know but I freaked out I was like I was, I was like we just ran over that dog whatever and I like looked behind me but there's nothing there and my obviously my parents were like what the fuck is wrong with our child <laughs> Is this why you're so calm playing horror games? Um, well, I like playing horror games for the adrenaline. So like Mortuary Assistant um, has been on my mind recently because it's like jump scares the game. Stuff like just pops out and it's like, it like gives me that, that rush. I know that not everyone else thinks like that and they're terrified, but I think it's pretty funny. I still have to, I still have to keep playing. I still have to stream Mortuary Assistant again because I want the other endings. But yeah, I think I only trick-or-treated like once in my life. Otherwise, I just buy candy. Um, maybe this year I'll like buy candy and if anyone, if anyone dares to knock on my door, I'll, uh, I'll give them something. Or maybe I can do that thing where it's like, you put a little, you put a little thing outside that says, please take some, don't knock on my door. 